All right, we love this portion of the show. We talk about the minor league players of the week, and this week we're going to focus on double A players. August the week of 14th through the 20th, and Jordan Wogu is our guy that is uh, we're going to focus today with the Chicago Cubs organization. Join us now. Hey, Jordan, what's going on, man? Good to see you. You too. All right, you got to explain your name, man, because everybody's looking at the spelling there. How are you pronouncing it? Wogu. The end is silent. I got it right. Yeah. I feel like dancing right now. All right, Jordan. Hey, uh, real interesting guy. You've had a great week. Tell me about the week you put together and how did it come together so well for you? Um, yeah, I've had an interesting year. It's just been a lot of swing changes uh, and a little bit of uh, finding my confidence again. Uh, I think that this week, the, the past week that I won it, it was just a matter of uh, kind of stick like getting yeah. back into like consistent consistent routine and then just trusting it well i see you yeah you you, you smoke some a breaking ball you hit another one you hit 15 home runs this year so we know the power is there let's talk about you a little bit it says you were born in ottawa canada yes sir uh did you grow up there i know it's one thing to be born somewhere did you grow up much in ottawa no so i was only there for about a year i don't even remember honestly yeah, I, I figured that because your, your your parents are both educators and they're both at University of Michigan. Am I right about that? Yeah. So did you grow up in Ann Arbor then? I grew up in Ann Arbor, yeah. Okay, I see. And now that, that, that you're coming full circle, University of Michigan. So growing up in Ann Arbor with your folks teaching there, you probably went to all the Michigan games. You're probably bleeding blue right now. You couldn't help but go to school there. Yeah, honestly... My, I never really went to, I went to maybe a couple growing up, but my parents weren't super big into like the athletic part. They just kind of wanted me to focus on the school and education growing up. Yeah, I, I, I'm looking at video now. I remember watching you because you guys made a pretty good run when you were at Michigan. I remember watching you. And one of the things that, about you that stood out is you studied computer science, you know, so it was yes, more sir. about your education. They even talked about that during your broadcast. Was that your parents' influence? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, they that was honestly I would have gone to Michigan regardless if I played baseball or not. So just to focus on school. Yeah, folks, that that's kind of the plan when you're done playing. I get you're going to do something with that degree, I'm sure, or head in that direction. Yes, sir. Yeah. Uh, Unknown right now, but I'll figure it out. Well, right now you you you're focusing on playing ball and getting to the big league. So, as you yeah. look at this year, you said it's been a little up and down. Uh, as you get ready to head now towards the end of the minor league season and we head to the winter, you get a chance to focus and refocus, I should say. What will you work on that you learned this year? It'll be all about approach, uh, consistency, routine, uh, focusing on what pitches I need to hit and what my zone is instead of kind of just focusing on hitting everything and more, more being like a, a, a real hitter instead of just swinging up there. Well, Jordan, I knew I'd come across you on a few different things uh, through the Players Alliance and different things like that. You wore number 42 in college. So, yeah. so tell me uh, about Jackie Robinson, how important that is for you. Uh, I mean, it's huge. He, he did it all for us. Uh, I wouldn't be here right now without him. So uh, we actually, back in, I think my sophomore year, the Mets, uh, we got to meet his maybe his, his, one of his relatives, his, yeah. the granddaughter. Yeah, she spoke with us, and it was actually super cool. And one quote that stuck with me is the, the impact of your life only matters when it, like, when it has an impact on others. Very uh, well done, man. That, man. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Well, hey, you keep doing what you're doing. You're impacting people all the way across. I'm super thrilled about your education. I'm sure your parents are, too. And now let's lock in on that baseball, get you to the big league. So keep swinging, man. All right? Thank you. Yes, sir.